Hi everyone! In this video we are going to show you how to create amazing animated headings effects. With the animated heading effects you can bring your pages to life and grab visitors' attention quickly. These animations are an excellent way to engage users and encourage them to explore the rest of your content. Plus you can use the animated highlighting feature. Let's open a page with a front-end editor and discover how to work with the animated heading effects. The animated heading effects are located in the Animation tab of the Heading module. If you need more information for the general options of this module, you can check the dedicated video. Uncode includes several animations for the Heading module, from the basic ones like Opacity, Zoom In and Out, Top or Bottom and Lateral or Right, to the advanced animations that options include curtain for lines, single word and letter, word sliding, and typewriter. The animated heading effects are very intuitive and easy to apply. Just choose one of the effects and the scripts will do the rest. You can customize these animations using parameters such as animation speed, animation delay, and animation interval. Let's test. Lines curtains, words curtains, letters curtains, and typewriter. While a page is being loaded, the feature can make sense of how your text is wrapped on various lines, words and letters according to the device being used, and apply the resulting animation for best effect. I'm changing the animation's parameters to better explain what happens. We see here that the animation is divided into three different lines, and each line appears progressively. If we test on mobile device, it is divided on four lines but the animation is always perfect. Since this is a fairly advanced behaviour, you just have to be careful about two possible errors. First, don't use any HTML markup. For example, if you copied your text from a website or from an application like Pages or Word, and the text has formatting inline styles, please remove these extra codes. In a few words, if you have problems, check that there are no codes in the text tab of Tiny MCE. Second, you need to make sure to have connected a valid font family. Before starting the animation, the script checks if the declared font is available. For example, if you see a delay in the animations, please verify that the fonts are correctly imported and set up. To make your text animations even more stunning, We've also added an easy to use shortcode that can add a highlighting or underscore effect to your headings. This effect can be either static or dynamic. What's more, you can customize the following settings for the animation. In our documentation, or inside the pages that use this effect from the demo contents, you can find a few examples we invite you to check. In this shortcode, there are various parameters that can be customized. For example, the background color, the opacity, the height, the animation, and the offset that lets you move the underline effect vertically to the desired location. Or I can easily modify some parameters. For example, the height to 30%. Nice one. Ready to make your web pages captivating with animated heading and highlighting effects?